y'all and happy hump day to y'all. How y'all doing out there today? I hope y'all doing good. Y'all, we got springtime today. It's upper 60s. <laughs> it's upper 60s today, y'all. But I think we'll get a storm tomorrow to bring it back down because it need to bring down. It ain't never this hot in January. But look, y'all, I know y'all telling me rambling and junk. But we got a good little meal for you. So when the temp do drop all the way down, we got a crock pot soup for you today, okay? Y'all, today, before we, hold on, because you're trying to skip out. Before we get started, if you have subscribed, please subscribe, comment, hit that like button. Also, hit the bell to be notified. If you got some extra time on your hands, go on and watch a commercial too. It help all the YouTubers out and stuff. That's how we get that little chain, chain, the coin, coin. But okay. <laughs> But look, y'all, today we're going to make us uh, some crock pot Mississippi chicken noodle soup, okay? You know, if y'all haven't tried just the Mississippi chicken, it's the bomb by itself. Imagine it being a soup with it, okay? So this is what we're going to do real quick and easy, okay? I already got everything cut up. Okay, I got one cup of celery. We're going to just go on and throw that off in there, okay? We got one cup of carrots. Put that in there. And this is like just a, a whole onion right here, okay? Just an onion. Okay, throw that off in there. My hands are clean for the people that's concerned and stuff about me having dirty hands and they're not eating the food. <laughs> but uh, it's clean. Okay, now the chicken... It could, okay, raise the camera up. The chicken depends on you. You can use chicken breast or whatever you want to use, okay? But I'm using chicken thighs because I like all the little grease and fat and stuff that come off chicken thighs, okay? But what I'm going to do, I'm going to take the chicken out when it's done and, you know, debone it, shred the chicken up, okay? So, let's go ahead. This is, I got uh, six pieces of chicken, bone in, skin on, and I'm just going to place them in there. But like I said, you can use any kind of chicken you want. I just love chicken thighs. Some people can't stand chicken thighs, but I love it. Okay. I really hope y'all doing good. I hope your New Year's going good. And everything, everything good for you, okay? We're going to just speak that. Everything is working out for your good this year. Everything. Okay. So now... We're going to put our little season packs on it. You get you one pack of ranch. Put that on there. One pack of ranch. One pack of... Oh, it's just gravy. <laughs> put that on there. Okay. Get you some pepperoncinis like this, okay? You can get the whole ones or the sliced ones. If you can't find the whole ones, get the sliced ones. I'm going to put, I already took some out. I'm just going to put some around the perimeter. Put some around there like this. And you can put as much as you want. Also, I'm going to put a little juice, a little juice. Okay. Now... Now, on this, I'm not going to put the butter where, you know, when you're just doing the Mississippi chicken or uh, Mississippi pot roast, you put your butter in there. I'm not going to put any butter, but I'm going to put about six cups of chicken broth. I'll put about six cups. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to cook this uh, on high for about, uh, for about four hours. Cook it on half about four hours. And that's all it is to it. Now, did y'all see how fast that was? Now, I'm going to put the top on. I'm going to put the top on. That was easy. Tell me that wasn't easy. I want somebody to raise their hand and say it wasn't easy. And I'm just going to hit start. It's on high. It says six hours, but I'm letting it cook for four hours, okay? And then uh, after that... All we're going to do is put our noodles in and let that cook for a little bit. Uh, you know, we, of course, we're going to take that uh, them chicken thighs out and debone it. But if you're using uh, chicken breast, all you got to do, you could just shred it while it's in the crock pot. But I'm using chicken thighs because I like that grease. <laughs> so I'm going to take it out, take the skin off, debone it, and put it back in the pot. And all you got to do is add this. But I'm going to let this cook for four hours. I'm going to see y'all when I get back. Bye. I'll be back. Okay, 
right, y'all. I shredded up the uh, chicken thighs, okay? This is it right here. So now I'm just going to uh, put this in the the juice and stuff and stuff, okay? So I'm going to put that in here. I took the skin off and I took the bone out. Oh, girl, you made me mess up. <laughs> Okay, and now what we're going to do, we're going to get our noodles, and we're going to put our noodles in there. This is real easy. I told y'all it was easy. We're going to put our noodles in there. And if you feel like you need any more uh, broth and stuff, just add some more uh, chicken broth to it. I think this bag is, uh, yeah, this is 12 ounces. But you don't have to put all of it. Because I don't put, I'm, I'm just putting half of the bag myself. Okay. Look at all that goodness, doll. Uh-huh. She cute already. She is cute already. I'm going to let this cook, let them noodles cook till they soft, and she's going to be ready. She is going to be ready. Okay? I'll be back. Hey, y'all. I'm back, y'all, and I'm finished with this crock pot Mississippi, ch Mississippi chicken noodle uh, soup, girl. You make me best stop. I'm finished with this Mississippi chicken noodle soup, girl. You trying to make me best stop. But look. Y'all, <laughs> I hope y'all having a good day today. Today, Wiz is hump day. Got, we finna have a bad storm tomorrow. It finna start early, early in the morning. Y'all know how I feel about storms and stuff and stuff. But look, if y'all having storms, y'all be safe out there and stuff. I ain't gonna hold y'all though. But look, go ahead and take a look at this chicken noodle soup. <laughs> this Mississippi chicken noodle soup. Look at her. Ain't she cute? She is cute. Girl, look at her. Oh, uh -huh. you see them vegetables. <laughs> you see them vegetables. Girl, yeah. It's, you see how fast it, well, not fast because in the crock pot it's slow cooking, but how easy it was. All you had to do was dump and let it go. And then at the end, all you had to do was put your noodles. But come put the camera up. All you had to do, look, let me tell you what you had to do. Cut your vegetables up before you have to go to work. Cut your vegetables up, them onions, them uh, the uh, celery, and the uh, doggone carrots. Put them to the side. Put them in the refrigerator until that morning. And then you put it in the crock pot. Put your chicken in there, even if you're using chicken thighs or chicken uh, breast or whatever. Put that in there. Put your season, your all oh, just gravy, and then the, uh, the uh, ranch and stuff. And you put that in there, put your pe pepperoncinis, and then just put your uh, your chicken broth in that junk, okay? Let that stuff cook while you at work. By the time you get home from work, then you just put your noodles in and boom, it's done. Cook them kids some doggone uh, grilled cheese sandwiches or something to go with it, or just put some crackers with it. That's a whole meal. You done. You ain't got to worry about nothing. You can go on and watch Tyler Perry shows to come on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and Fridays, and all that. That's all you got to do, okay? But yeah, <laughs> y'all, thank y'all so much for tuning in with me today, y'all. I hope you have a fabulous week amazing week and stuff. Please stay safe. I know it's all kinds of crazy stuff going on. Prayers to California with all them floods and stuff and just everybody who having bad storms and stuff. Prayers to y'all. Please stay safe. I'm going to see y'all again next time. Love y'all. Bye-bye.